Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, or welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be reading Pete the Cat, Fighter Fighter Pete by James Dean. Let's get started. We are going on a class trip today, says Principal Nancy. She leads the class to a bright yellow bus. Everyone climbs on board. I wonder where we are going, says Pete. They are going to visit the firehouse today. The bus parks next to the bright red firehouse. Pete and his classmates are excited. The firehouse is huge. It's so big it can hold two long red fire trucks and all of the firefighters' equipment. Cat Firehouse. The fighter fighters show the kids around. They give everyone a turn to ring the old brace fire bell outside the firehouse. Ring. Then all the kids take turns sliding down the fighter fighters pole. Wee! Callie yells as the she glides down. The fighter fighters allow the kids to try on their gear. Fighter fighters wear a lot of equipment. First, Pete puts on the heavy black overalls. And he steps into the tall black boots. A fighter fighter helps Pete put on the heavy yellow jacket. Finally, they place a hard black helmet on Pete's head. All this gear is very heavy. Pete can barely move. The fighter fighters allow the kids to explore one of the fire trucks. Callie sits on the driver's seat. She presses the horn. Bird. It's so loud that all the kids cover their ears. Then Pete turns on the sirens and lights. The sirens blare. Wee wee. The lights flash red and yellow. Suddenly, a loud bell rings in the firehouse. Uh oh! It's a fire alarm. There's a fire in town. Gear up, Pete. The firefighters scramble to their gear very quickly. Pete puts on his gear too. They all climb aboard the fire truck and turn on the sirens and lights. Firefighter Pete and the firefighters are on the way. Wooey, wooey! The fire engine races through town. The lights flash round and round. A firefighter presses the horn. Bert! All the other cars move out of the way. There's the fire. It's hot and loud. But the firefighters know exactly what to do. They work together as a team to connect the fire truck to the fire hydrant. Then the firefighters also attack a long, heavy hose to the truck. Firefighter gives Pete the signal, and the firefighters turn on the water. Whoosh! The water gushes out very fast. Several firefighters must hold the hose to control it. Pete helps direct the hose as they spray the fire with water. The fire is starting to go out. There is smoke everywhere. Suddenly, Pete hears yelling from the roof. Oh no! It's Grumpy Toad. He needs to be rescued. The firefighters raise a long ladder from the truck. Crank, crank. Crank! The ladder goes up and up and up. Fighter Fighter Pete and other firefighters help Grumpy Toad climb down the ladder carefully. Yay! The fire is out and everyone is safe. The fighter fighters drive back to the firehouse. They take off all their gear. They pat Pete on the back and say, "Fighter Fighter Pete helped save the day." Good job, Pete. The end. I hope you guys like this video. If you do, make sure to like and subscribe and ring the notifications button. Then it will let you know when we upload more videos. Bye, and see you next time.